Hey you guys, it's Shannon and today I'm so excited but I'm finally doing what I got for Christmas. Alright, so this is good. I got a lot of gifts and I first just want to put a disclaimer out that, whoa, oh my god you guys, it's super scary windy outside. Like I think that tree might break off and fall into my patio window. Ooh. And I'm home alone, it's scary. Okay, Bandit. Don't get all my toys. Don't play with all my toys. All right, so <laughs> I just wanted to put a disclaimer that uh, Christmas is not all about gifts. I feel very blessed and fortunate to be able to have been given all these amazing gifts, and I did not ask for them. They were not expected. I just feel so lucky. I know Christmas is not all about the presents, but I wanted to share what I got with you guys. So I'm going to start out with this. This is a Tiffany's um gift that my mom gave me it's a glass jewelry box and i think it is so so awesome and beautiful and oh gosh i just can't wait to put my jewelry in it so yes that is what my mom got me from tiffany's and i love it then the second thing my mom got me were these bought bose uh headphones and i actually wanted um some new headphones but i would never buy headphones for myself these are great for editing and for like on the plane and just like when you want to listen to good music so i was really excited about these she also got travis a pair and yeah i just love them and i can't wait to open it up and start using them the next thing i got from my cousin sammy who is just adorable and i love her so much she got me these betsy johnson socks and there's a pair missing because I wore them like right on Christmas when I got them. But check out all these awesome designs of different socks. You guys see that? They're really, really cute and cool. And I would totally go through all of them. But I really do have a lot of gifts and I want to try to make this video not too long. So, all right, what's next? Oh my gosh, this is hilarious. So, as some of you guys know, I collected Pez dispensers when I was younger. And so I have so many of them. And when we were moving, Travis was like, what in the world are all these Pez dispensers? Do you really need those? And I was like... Well, I kind of collected them over the years. So he got me this big ass Ninja Turtle one and I just thought that was really cool and awesome. And so yeah, I'm excited to add it to my Pez collection, which I don't even, they're in boxes right now. I need to like make a cool display to like show them off. Also, if you're wondering this nail polish I have on, it's just this uh, Sally Hansen's nail effect stuff. It's really cool. And then the little tattoos that you see on my face and on my Hands, these are from um, MrKate.com. And I'm not sponsored at third. I bought them myself. <laughs> okay, let's see. What else? Oh, this is just so cute. So my other cousin Nikki got me this. It's like a little headband, and I love like hair accessories, mainly because I have like roots growing out and I don't feel like doing my hair and it's a hot mess. So I just like throw something on to cover it up, like today, as you can tell, and I'm still in my onesie. I did do my makeup for you guys though, so <laughs> maybe you can give a thumbs up for that. <laughs> Here we go. This bag was one of my gifts. It's like a monogrammed bag my older sister got me. And I love it because I really wanted a cute bag for, um, you know, like my wedding planning and stuff. So I thought this was perfect. And it's like a big heavy duty, like canvas bag. So I'm excited about that. And then a bunch of my Christmas presents are in here. So I'm just gonna quickly go through them. So here was just like a stocking stuffer. My mom got me these little hair clips which was awesome. She also got me this Bellatrix, <laughs> Bellatrix High Shine Gloss. It was really cool and pretty, so I like that. She also got me some dry shampoo, which God knows I could use. So this is a really random one. She got everybody like these breathalyzer keychains, you know, like the kind you can get from Costco, which is such a great gift, but I don't drink anymore at least. So I don't know if this was like an accident that she gave this to me, but I was like, I'll take it and leave it at my house in case like, I don't know, I one day have a friend come over and they're drinking and then, I don't know, I have no idea. Um, oh, this was a really sweet gift. So um, my mom's boyfriend, Jim, has a daughter named Jamie and she came over with her daughter and she was in one of the last vlogs when we were like making snow and stuff. And um, Jamie got me this beautiful, beautiful bracelet. I love it so much so pretty you guys look can you see that oh I thought that was so sweet this is hilarious so my other cousin Brett came over and <laughs> he got me this funny card and it said um, Santa knows you've been 
or Santa knows if you've been naughty or nice. And then it opens up and it says, but it looks like you get something anyway, which is really funny. And then he got me a, oh my gosh, that is my cat. He's using litter box, like literally right there. And so it's so loud, sorry guys. Um, it got me a Fandango gift card, so that was really sweet. And then, oh my gosh, so my Aunt Jennifer and my Uncle Lance, they know that like Trav and I go snowboarding. They had like a box and they had like three different snowboard things in there and one of them were these like so cute pink socks that are like really thick and they're for like snowboarding and I needed new socks so this was so cool and they're hot pink which that's awesome because it match, matches my snowboarding pants and then they also got me this how freaking awesome I love the color it's so bright and fun uh, and this is this goes around your neck so like you know it's one of these things to keep your neck warm when you're snowboarding and I just love it so soft and cozy and I can't wait to wear it and then she also got me these little uh, earbuds for when I'm snowboarding so I can listen to music which is probably not a good idea because I'm not that good at snowboarding and I might hit somebody <laughs> okay so this next thing was an Amazon gift card that my aunt Donna got me which was really sweet and I buy so much stuff on Amazon so definitely use that and then Jim my mom's boyfriend got me this vegan food gifts book which is so cool. There's actually something in here that like cracked me up. Oh my gosh, okay, here it is. So I was looking through the book and I saw like, they put brownies in like a little pot thing and then I look on the other side and they called it pot brownies. Do you get it? Oh my gosh, so funny. That just kind of like made me laugh. I don't do drugs, but it was, that's comical. Come on, you guys, that's pretty funny. So it's like a really fun, like creative, fun book and I'm really excited to start reading it and making the recipes from there. Then my mom got me this, oh, I love these shirts. They're like long sleeve, do you see this? And then they also have like the little thumb holes, which I really like. And then the back of it is just really cute too. And it's like kind of scrunchy. And then it's like scrunchy on the sides. I don't know if you guys can see. Super cute, she got me another one too. I don't know where it is. Okay, then she got me these black jeans, which fit me really well and I'm really excited about those. Uh, she also got me a pair of leggings, some blue leggings and some black ones that are soft and like really warm. Um, then I got this scarf that has little like studs on it. So I thought that was really cute. Oh, here's another like shirt just like that pink one I showed you. And it's got like this really cool design on it. I don't know if you guys can see it, but isn't that so cool? And it's just like the last one with like the thumb holes and stuff. It's just to wear with like jeans or leggings when you're going out and it's like cold outside. Um, she also got me a shower cap, like a stocking stuffer thing. Aw, and then Travis wrote me this really sweet card. It said, I have a special place in my heart for you. I have a special place within my heart that's meant for you alone. It's filled with lasting memories of special times we've known. It's filled with all the dreams and hopes and joys that we share too, along with the happiness my heart can wish for you. And then he wrote, to my love, my fiance and my best friend, my soulmate and my everything. I love you so much. Merry Christmas, my gorgeous princess. Love your fiance, AKA Travis. Oh, and there's two little bears because we tell we call each other bear or like boogly bear. So I just thought that was really sweet. I can't save it forever. Gosh, it's so windy outside. It's like scary. And Travis got me a dry suit for water skiing. So that was like one of my main gifts. And then he's also, he put these little things in and it basically said like, Good for one new comfy back brace for snowboarding, plus a date night out and dinner and a movie. So that was really cute. And then he's also gonna get me like a snowboard helmet. So that's what's on this one. Uh, let's see what else. Oh, and then these little rocks were really cute. My cousin was like, I was out and I saw these and it made me think of you. And it's basically a gratitude rock and then like an imagine rock. And I just, I loved that. So that was really sweet. And Travis, he put, took this huge stocking, bought this huge stocking, and he put that Ninja Turtle thing in it, the Pez dispenser, so that was really cute. So that was all that was in this bag. Then I got these, my mom gave me these cool Barbie bags. I guess like someone at her work, uh, wife or something, is like the CEO or something at the Mattel company, so they always bring in these Barbie bags, and I was like, those are so cool, I want one, so she gave me one. And then let's see what is in this bag is full of stuff and then I have a few more other things. Oh, this is a handmade frame that my little sister 
um, gave for me and the back's like really cool. I thought that was cute and sweet. Oh, my mom got me a case for my iPad mini because I didn't have one. My little sister got me this adorable, oh my gosh, I cannot wait to like wash this and start using this. It's so, so super soft. It's like this long um, nighty, like it's like a big long sleeve, uh, what is it called? Like, you know, like pajamas or whatever. And it's super, super soft and oh, it's just so cute. I love it. Cannot wait to start using that. My mom also got me another pair of leggings. It's so funny because we were in the store and I saw this pattern. She's like, oh, do you like these? And I'm like, not really. They're kind of too loud for me. And then I guess she already bought them. And then I opened them and I was like, oh, shit. She's like, I already bought those for you. She's like, you can return them. And then I was like, no, because like when I wear them, they won't be as like crazy, you know? I don't know. It's kind of funny. Then I bought myself a Christmas present. I found this when I was shopping at the mall with my mom and I thought this was so freaking cool. So I got this and then I also got the matching like sweats to go with it. So it's like a little sweatsuit and I thought that was so cool. So yeah, I got those. She also got me this scarf ring holder, which I thought was really neat because you could put all your scarves in there and it doesn't take up that much space in your closet. And right now all my scarves are like shoved in a drawer. So this is really, really cool. Got something in the mail from somebody that I've never met before, but I think she works with the, um, I don't know if the company is called Porn, uh, Jesus Loves Porn Stars. I'm not really sure what the company is called, but it's basically like a Christian group that, um, you know, works with people in the adult entertainment industry, and I'm not really too sure, but she's always been super sweet to me, and this Christmas, this card was really sweet, and I, like, I wasn't expecting this at all. It felt like very, it was very sweet and sentimental, and I don't know, I really liked it. So the first thing was just, she got me these, like, lip glosses and this really cool little case thing, and then she also got me... She also got me this really pretty eyeshadow from Ulta. It's like this gold color, perfect for like New Year's and like going out and stuff. And then this was probably like the sweetest thing I think, or not the sweetest, but like the most sentimental, like thoughtful thing was she sent me this um, women's devotional Bible and I was like, oh, that was really sweet. And then I opened it up. So it's like super, super nice and it's, you know, like a woman's devotional Bible, I guess. But the best part was that she had written in it to me and she said, Shannon, you have one of the sweetest spirits I know. May you always know you were created with a purpose. Love, Michelle. And it like, almost makes me want to cry. It's just really sweet, so. Yeah, I really like that. And then she also, um, she also sent me this, uh, it's a book that she had that she read and she sent it. I think she found out that Travis and I got engaged. So it's called uh, Love Language Minute Devotional. And yeah, it's really cool because you can tell it's like been used and um, she wrote a note in it and it said, Dear Shannon, this was mine and I want you and Travis to have it. May you be blessed in all the days, all the days of your life. Love, Michelle. So that was just really sweet and and really thoughtful and for her just to send me something like I've never met her before and it was just really sweet. Um, Lisa Becker, who watches my channel, sent me a package for Christmas which was so sweet. She really didn't have to do that and it just like, I don't know, it made me feel very special. So thank you very much. One of those things was this really awesome ring from Smashbox and at first I just thought it was like a really fancy, really cool ring, but if you open it up, there's lipstick in it, which that was just freaking awesome. So loved that. And then she also sent me these really fancy mud masks, like it's called Glam Glow, and they're just like these really fun, fancy like mud mask things. So I'm excited to use those. She also sent a planter with like this this really cool planter thing, and I have that growing outside and a bunch of big toys for Bandit the cat. So that was really sweet. Then. Then um, I have another thing, another, this is actually full, it's not just one thing in here. So let me open this up. So my dad and his girlfriend got me this recipe organizer and it's really cool because you open it up and it's all like laminated where you can put like recipes in it. And then it has these 
um, things in the back like appetizers, soups and salads, vegetables. <laughs> What's even a lot cooler is that it has like the sizes and measurement things because I'm terrible at math and I'm like not good at that stuff and so that was cool that like all that was in here and then it has just like microwave tips and um, herbs and spices and cooking terms and I don't know it was really really cool so I was excited about that. Then they got me some Skittles which are vegan by the way. S.A. Chipotle gift card. Glosses from Victoria's Secret. Very cool. A car freshener. <laughs> a um, towel, like not a towel, but like a back scrubber for the shower. And then I freaking love this. It is a Victoria's Secret hoodie. And last year they got me a pink one and this year they got me a turquoise one. So I just love it and I wear these all the time. So I was really excited about that. And then last but not least, <laughs> I saved this for last. You've probably seen it behind me was my mom bought me Uggs for Christmas. Now, I didn't ask her to buy me Uggs, and um, she does this every year. I should have known just to tell her, like, you don't have to get me Uggs this year, um, you know. But I never tell her, like, I want something. She kind of just buys stuff for me. So she did get me um, some, some brand new uh, black Uggs, and... Obviously, I would never buy these for myself, but since they were a gift, I am going to keep them and wear them. I wear my Uggs every day. I do not support buying Uggs anymore because I am vegan, but, uh, you know, I wasn't going to be rude and tell my mom to, like, return them, and, you know, I didn't want it to be weird, so. But I really do um, like Uggs, even though, I, like I said, I would not, pur I don't purchase, I would never purchase them again. I do have them and I am still going to wear them and since these were a gift I am going to keep them and wear them. So I think that's all for my gifts. It's a lot of stuff. You should see this mess around me right now. But I just wanted to share that with you. Um, I hope that you guys all had an amazing Christmas, amazing holiday, whatever you guys did or celebrated. Um, and just remember that not everybody is as fortunate enough to get gifts like this, I know that I'm, I feel so lucky and so blessed. Just know that if for some reason you weren't able to, you know, get the gifts that you really wanted this year or your family wasn't able to afford them, you know, to get gifts or whatever, just know that it's not material things that make you happy. Yes, getting gifts is like so exciting and you're like, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I, I got these things, but it, it really is temporary. It doesn't last that long. The things that mean the most and are the greatest gifts in the world are having family and friends and people that love you and support you. No amount of money in the world or presents or whatever is ever going to give you that happiness. That's true happiness. So don't let that get you down and you know tomorrow's a new year. You never know or tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow's a new day. You never know what can happen. So just stay positive. Spread love and kindness. Be nice to each other and just know that I love you so much more than anything in the world. I'm sending you all my love and all my positive energy and I hope to see you in tomorrow's video. Bye!